To begin using 90 Second Website Builder, you need to first download it from our website. Click the download link and then choose Save File. Don't choose Open, but Save File and then click OK. This will begin the download process. A zip folder will be placed on your computer in your downloads area. You can move that folder to your desktop if it's easier for you to work with. The next thing to do is to unzip this folder. Now you can do that in Windows 7 by simply right clicking and going to Extract All or you can use any unzipping program you want to. Either way, extract the folder or unzip it, and a second folder will appear near it, on the desktop or wherever you're working. This is the unzipped version of that folder. Inside is the application. It's called Setup, and you just double click on it to start the installation process. Now during the installation, all you really need to do is click the Next button. The first thing you'll do is agree to the terms, and then again, click Next. The program is going to show you where it will be installing the software, but all you need to do is click Next. It's going to show you where the desktop icon or shortcut is going to be installed, and again, you click Next. At some point, you'll click Next, and then the installation process will begin. You'll know that it's installing because it will show you the files by showing a green bar across the window. When this installation process is complete, it'll show you one final window that says it's been installed successfully, and you simply click Finish. Next, you'll see an icon on your desktop. This is a shortcut to the software. Now, if you're upgrading right now, you may still see an older icon. That's okay. It will still launch the new version of the software. This icon will be replaced with the new icon the next time you reboot your computer. Either way, you can double-click on this shortcut to launch the software. When you launch the program, you'll be asked if you are still using the trial version or if you're ready to activate your software. Now, if you're still using the trial version, the program will show you how many days left you have. In my case, I have 12 days. You may have 30 days. But either way, if you are still using the trial version, you won't need to activate the software or insert anything into these fields. All you'll need to do is simply click the Continue with Trial Version button. As long as you have, still have some time left on your trial version, you can continue to use the software. However, if you purchase the software and you're ready to activate it, it's really easy to do. Here you're going to insert your registration email and serial number in these fields. Now, you get these in the email we sent you after you purchased your license. You'll simply fill in these two fields and click the Activate button. Type or paste in the registration email that appears in the information we sent you and type in or paste in the serial number, sometimes called the activation code for your software. And that goes in this other field. Once you've provided your license information, you simply click Activate and you're ready to launch 90 Second Website Builder. Again, if you're using the trial version, you would click the Continue with Trial version. This launches the program and a blank screen will open up so you can begin making websites. Now you're ready to start building as many websites as you want to with 90 Second Website Builder.